Hi folks, this is All The Fruit and here I am again on the beautiful island of Gran Canaria making again a goji berry video and I'm not ashamed of it because look at that plant that's the wild canary island goji berry Lucium intricatum I made a video of this goji berry last year on the island of Tenerife over there you can see it faintly behind those hills in the sea and there, in a whole population of koji berries, I found only one single teeny tiny fruit. Then when I found, well, uh, an acceptable amount of fruit in a population here in Gran Canaria this year, I made another video. But both videos were done in conditions of severe drought. Here, right now, I'm in the town of Agaete. And as you can see, we had ample rain about a month ago. Everything is green. All this was, well, it was a little bit green a month ago, but nothing like that. And most goji berry bushes have no or very few fruit or a mediocre amount of fruit. I don't think I've, I ever remember having seen a goji berry shrub with a decent amount of fruit in the Canary Island. This is the first one I've seen in years. I don't know if this is the maximum of fruit you can have on Lucium Etricatum or if this is just because here, well, also here we had drought. It was not as severe as in the south, but we had a couple years of drought. And this bush, it's not growing down in the valley, it's growing on a slope. So it did not get a perfect amount of water, but apparently it got enough to produce thousands of good sized goji berries. And I kind of doubt that this was just after the rain. I don't know, maybe a lot of fertilizer from this field was thrown here years ago. I don't know why this bush has so many goji berries. They are big for Canary Island goji berries. They are juicy. Mm. And they are sweet without any taste of bitterness. I think after a really wet winter, the harvest can be even better. This is just one bush which has probably like half a kilo of them. Look, this is the size of a really big one. Almost the size of a pea. Amazing, and the taste is good, sweet. I really wonder if the guanches or the canarios before the advent of Europeans use those berries on a large scale because nowadays we have a lot of fruit on the Canary Islands but all those fruit were brought by the Europeans basically <laughs> the Canary Island people before the advent of Europeans they had almost no fruit so I guess something like that which grew in the lower coastal areas which are even poorer in fruit and which tasted sweet Sweet with a hint of sourness and almost no flavor. Should have been used by them for food. Does anybody know if the Canary Island natives used goji berries for food before the advent of Europeans? Because look, imagine thousands and thousands of those shrubs on one slope having this amount of gojis. You could, like a whole tribe of natives could stuff their faces with them. It's so amazing. And those are the first goji berries which I actually find tasty without a trace of bitterness. So folks, now I'm finishing the video and starting to munch on the goji berries. Stay tuned for a lot more fruit videos from the beautiful island of Gran Canaria. And don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe.